Hey, what's going on guys? So I want to learn 24 karat magic, the jazzy version. Uh, another nice way to get into jazz chords, um, a lot of it in R&B music. So what we're going to do, we're going to start on the 8th fret of the 5th string. And we're going to play this shape here, which is 8, 6, 8, 8. There's pretty much two chords throughout the whole song, it's just the intro that's a little bit convoluted, but it's nice. So from there we go up to here, which is like that, 8th fret on the 6th string, just barring that, leaving this as a gap because it's a, it's a minor 7, so it's from that there, that is a C sharp major 7. Now the next one, it's a half diminished chord on the 10th fret, it goes 10, 11, 10, 11. Try and mute the bottom and top string because we're not playing those. I can't remember what this, this chord's called, but it's uh, 8, gap, 8, 9, 9. And again, muting every string that we don't play with the little tips of our fingers. And then back to the beginning. And that happens twice at the beginning, so... So that happens twice, and then it goes into the, um, the verse. So, all the verse is, is the beginning chord, right, that one, and then barring the 6th fret, so that's an A sharp minor 7. Now, halfway through the verse part, it'll do, which is the major 7 here, on the ninth fret, and then that end chord of the introduction. So. And at the at the end of um each verse I just go which is just sliding down. Um the strumming pattern's a little bit complicated. Um I basically play it like a really fast bossa nova um, track. There's plenty of tutorials on how to do um, bossa nova picking patterns. Basically you keep your bass finger, which is your thumb, and the actual melody fingers like this separate. And that should be the song. Um, any problems or anything like that, give me a message and yeah, see you later.